Okay, so there is a way for you to change the speed of videos and songs or audio. And I'm going to show you first with a video, um, with a video file. I do this a lot if I'm adding something in the background like dust or glitter or whatever I might do. And I'm, I usually kind of mute it as well by going in the opacity. But here we have it at the regular speed. If you go up into components, take clip speed, drop it on the element, it could be in settings motion. If you go to effects, it is on. You can turn it off, turn it on, or the X will delete it. If you click on speed, you can slow it down. See how it got bigger? Or you can speed it up. So here, it's going to be going faster. And if I want to make it slower, I can go, it won't go below 50, and then it will go slower. And I do that sometimes if I want it in the background of a video, and I just can keep copying and pasting. I'm using, actually I'm using the Control D, and then I can just add it, and then it just goes in the back of my video. So you can do that with video files, you can do that with audio files. So I already grabbed this one. I went up into music and this is in happy and I took wake up right here. So I just downloaded it and then I click and drag it to my timeline. Now what I can do is I can again go up, grab clip speed. I'm gonna mute this one so two aren't playing. And you can see what happens. I put the effect here, I have clip speed, I can make it play longer, and you can already see how the waveform changed, or I can make it go faster. And you can see how the waveform changes. So then it's going to go really fast instead of the original. You can also do this with audio. So if you, as I talk, I already printed something out. So you can go in here and type in, I'm just using the Google. I can generate the speech. I can preview there it. There are so many wonderful things you can do in Create Studio. That's going to be fine. I just hit import. I put it here. I'm going to duplicate it just so we can see what it looks like. We're going to hide it so we don't hear it twice. Here's the normal. There are so many wonderful things you can do in Create Studio. I can again go up, take clip speed, then and I click on that, I go to effects, clip speed. I can make it, I can have her talking at a slower rate. There are so many wonderful things you can do in Create Studio. You could make her go much faster if you want. <laughs> I don't know what this is gonna sound there like. There are so many. Oh, it cut it all off. So that might not be a good idea, but I don't know why you would wanna do that anyways but you could slow things down or speed things up with audio. Hope that helps.